Tonight, I want to talk to you about financial attitudes. Yes, you heard that right. Because your financial attitude, in my opinion, actually will determine if you are a saver or a spender. So listen up to me right now. You know, over all the years that I've been doing this, you have to wonder why is it that some people do like to save and some people like to spend? Sometimes you call in and you go, my parents were incredible savers. They saved every single penny, yet you are a spender. Sometimes you call in and you say, my parents spend, 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 but you are a saver. So it's not always how you were raised and your parents did this. It has a lot more to do with how you feel about who you are and your attitude towards your life as well as your work. I have also found in all the years that I've been doing this that we tend to spend more than when we feel less than. That when we have a job, when we have a relationship, and we are miserable in that job, we hate going to work, we hate our boss, we hate the people we work with, we hate coming home, whatever it is, we then start to feel that we are entitled to spend money. We're entitled to spend money because we have spent so many hours making this money in something that we hate. So that's when we start to become a spender because we're not liking something. Our attitude towards work, our relationship, or even your attitude towards yourself. So when you start to hate things about who you are, who you're with, or how you spend your time, that normally translates into spending money so that you feel better because you actually hate the time that you're spending making this money. However, on the other hand, you love yourself, you love your relationship, you love your job, you enjoy going in. You tend to be savers because you're not feeling entitled to have to spend this money. You're feeling like, oh my God, I love what I'm doing, so let's just save it. Everything happens to be in sync. So the solution to your problems aren't just making more money, throwing more money, doing this. The solution to your problem isn't also leave the relationship, leave the job. The real solution is changing your financial attitude. Can you just make some fine tuning adjustments and understand, all right, you have a job. Maybe you don't like the job. Can you find something about the job that you do like? Can you find something about the relationship that you're in that you do like? Or make some adjustment in yourself so you learn to love your life and what you have and don't spend time wishing that you had something other. So if you could just change your attitude Kind of change your glasses, you know, go and just get a different prescription in your glasses and see things differently. You very possibly could go from a spender to a saver, from having financial misery to really being happy. You really could change your entire life around.